So, today is the 29th of February, uh, 2024, a Thursday, and I woke up at like 12 o'clock, and it was some well-needed rest. My brain is still burning, but not as bad. Um, I hate when I get my little brain burns, it hurts, but yesterday it was making me feel so ill, so sick, not great, I literally just, oh god, but it's still burning a little bit, but not as bad, so that's good. It's mainly like here and here, but yesterday it was so bad, it was my whole brain and I just felt so dizzy and sick. But, feeling a little better now, so I'm going to organise my room because, uh, well, let me just show you guys. I completely forgot about the shutter function. Ready? I'm going to take the shutter down and you're going to see my room. So, uh, yeah, not too bad. But not great either, you know? Um, yeah. If you are, if you're not subscribed already, I definitely recommend checking out my second channel, Madaladder. I make a lot of, um, disability content. Well, I'm trying to this year, especially. I'm trying to put my best foot forward. And I have some ideas, but if you're interested, go check it out. <laughs> It's 35 minutes past 5. I've just realised it's the leap year day today. It's the 29th of February. Normally it's only the 28th. Happy leap year day, guys. Uh, but I'm really tired. Did a little bit in my room, but got really burnt out. I'm really fatigued and just really tired. Um, my brain's burning, like I mentioned earlier. And I don't feel good. I'm probably going to make a cup of tea in a minute. I've been listening to Renee rap. Um, listen to the rest of her songs. I listened to like half of them. Uh, the previous month and now I'm listening to the other half and I've just realised it's the 29th of February so I should really film my songs I've discovered um, in February video probably tonight so I'll probably finish up this vlog at some point soon and then at some point film my little um, songs I discovered video either today or a push tomorrow because, you know, I want it up for either, probably won't be done by tonight, but like pretty soon basically because it was songs I discovered in February, you know. Um, but yeah, I'm just listening to Renee Rap currently. Colorado is going to play. Um, I'm doing this thing where I have it queued up four times, so I'm listening to the song four times in a row so it sticks in my brain because if I just listen to it once I won't remember it as well as if I listen to it four times in a row you know. Hello it is the 1st of March uh, 2024 a Friday and I thought I nearly deleted this vlog then but I realised I deleted the old footage luckily what I was trying to do Jesus Christ I'm aware that my hair looks horrendous um yeah bad fibro flare up the last two days have not washed my hair Grim, I know, but my shower at the moment is really, really, really cold, like freezing, like Baltic, and the idea of going under a freezing cold shower whilst also ill with fibromyalgia symptoms, and I struggle to regulate my temperature with my fibromyalgia, sounded like hell. Um, but oh my god, that is grim. Um... And I have naturally oily hair anyways, so as you can tell, my hair needs a good wash, but um, but these pyjamas are really comfy, and I've got this like snuggly pyjama jumper on, which is really nice, but Jesus Christ, I did not realise just how bad my hair was until looking at that. nudged you <laughs> what <laughs> i just read a notification that's like this person nudged you what does that even mean but yeah um what was i saying oh yeah i thought i'd actually delete the vlog i didn't i was gonna film maybe my discovering music but i'm not with this hair jesus christ um been working on my YouTube videos, 
made some tomato and cheese pasta which I was really proud of myself for because if you know me you'll know I'm not the best cook in the world so it's the start of me learning how to cook um yeah but yeah I've not really been that great with my fibromyalgia the last two days my head's burning a lot less than it was but it's been really burny the past like two days especially the other day oh my god I felt so ill I couldn't leave bed but I did start on my room a little bit but yeah and the main thing is sorting out this hair ew oh do you guys want a navel piercing update hold on it's definitely doing a lot better it's definitely healing some crusties but it's doing good um yeah it's healing a lot i like it it is definitely looking good i mean it's a little bit crusty but it's not really that sore at all i forget it's there and i think it's healing well i got my navel pierced on the 12th of february so on the 12th of march it will be one month, my little navel piercing, and it's already doing so much better, so that's good news. Um, yeah, it doesn't hurt, really. It was doing a little bit, like, it was being a little bit sore a little bit ago, but it's, uh, like, not today, I mean, like, a couple of days ago, but it's doing a lot, lot, lot better, and, yeah, I'm happy with it so far. Hello, so it's 57 minutes past one, the 1st of March, 2024, um, a Friday, and I've not long woke up, um, and what did I first think about when I first woke up? Hedgehogs. Anyways, um, so, don't follow my advice, don't do this at home. If you know you have an allergy, avoid it, or manage it, right? But, I am silly and self-destructive a little bit and I got these hazelnut proline chocolates for my birthday and I was like you know what probably fine and you know what it was probably fine I mean my throat's a bit scratchy and it's a little bit burny at my mouth like tingly but like I know my allergy isn't so like severe that I can't eat it it just feels weird and it hurts my throat but, I had a couple last night, and I was like, oh, my throat doesn't feel great. And then, I had a couple this morning just so I woke up, and I'm like, again, scratchy. But, um, yeah, I try and avoid stuff with, like, excessive nuts in, because last time I had, like, a, a walnut carrot cake, and it had loads of nuts in it, and oh my god, that was awful. I had like this really, really, it was so fucking sore, and um, I felt really weird, and I'd had a rash come up my arm. So, I try to avoid stuff that's like nuts plastered all over it, but I couldn't help myself. It was seashell, chocolate, and... I know my allergy isn't bad enough to be like, and I knew there wouldn't be like too much in it, but I wouldn't like go out of my way to eat something that's like got like proper like nuts on it or something like that, or like filled, and I mean filled with nuts, I wouldn't do that far, but I couldn't help it, I love nuts, I... my favourite is pistachio, I love pistachio ice cream, it's my favourite flavour of ice cream, and now I'm like, oh great. So you're telling me I can't have my favourite flavour ice cream? I probably could. Like, my allergies aren't so bad that, like... Like, some people have really, 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 really severe nut allergies. And it's like, no. Absolute no-go. And nut allergies can be extremely serious. And if someone has a nut allergy, respect it, you know? But mine is, like, so mild on the spectrum of nut allergies that like I can be around them some people can't 
Okay, some people can't. Um, I can eat them. Some people can't. But I will. Depending on how much nut content, the bigger the reaction. But I never used to, and I noticed it a few years ago, I was like eating some chocolate and I was like, hmm, my mouth feels all weird and tingly. And I didn't make the connection, and then I ate something else and I was like, oh, tingly. And I've realised it's nuts, especially after that walnut cake. Oh my god, my, my god, that was the worst reaction I ever had to nuts. Because it was just plastered in nuts. And I remember saying to my sister, like, this has nuts in it, doesn't it? And she was like, no, you could see them on the cake, right? I was like, Naomi, those are walnuts. She was like, I'll just try some, it's not nuts, it's not nuts. So I did, and uh, I spent hours with an insanely sore mouth and throat and feeling really weird. And my arm was all like rashy and stuff and itchy. And I was like, so, moral of the story, nut allergies are serious, mine is not that bad, but I wouldn't go out of my way to like, eat a whole bag of nuts, if you know what I mean. It was just mainly because it was my birthday chocolate, and like, maybe a little bit every now and then will be okay, you know, because my allergy isn't the worst, but. Allergies are serious, and if someone tells you they have a nut allergy, bit my lip in my sleep. We love that. If someone tells you they have a nut allergy, take it seriously. Listen to their requests. I know some people who literally cannot be in the same room as them. It's like life threatening. Some allergies are life threatening. I think there's like intolerances, then there's allergies, and then there's different types of like scale of allergy. Like for example, my hay fever. Oh my god, in the summer I cannot fucking breathe. My mouth swells up. I my eyes seal shut. I am so allergic to flowers and like nature and, and in general, like mine's really bad. Grass, flowers, pollen, anything naturey. The tree bark, I'm pretty sure. The tree barks are anything naturey. My body's like, <sighs> but my nut allergy, if it even is a nut allergy, and not me just being weird, is like really mild. Still eat them, still be around them, just feel a bit weird. And what else? I think I'm lactose intolerant, but I haven't been tested because, uh, Starting to connect the dots a little bit. I need to, do you know what I need to do? I need to go and get an allergy test done so I know exactly what. Am I allergic to nuts or am I just like having a weird reaction sometimes to something else? Am I, well I know I'm allergic to fucking flowers but like, you know, what types? Because I think I'm allergic to basically everything because from my experience, everything makes me feel terrible. Like especially, and in the winter, all year round. I have an allergy to like flowers and plants and stuff and if I hold something plant like for like long enough I will literally be so itchy and like rashy and horrible and I sh like it affects my breathing like I I'm really badly allergic to plants but it'd be interesting to know like if there's like a specific one that just leaps through the leap but I doubt it but what I'm trying to say is I should probably get an allergy test at some point because it sounds like a good idea, to be honest, you know? So I'm aware of what I'm allergic to and what I'm not allergic to. Um, yeah, and I do recommend following your own, like, allergy advice and keeping yourself safe. Don't do what I do, which is, I know that I'm most likely mildly allergic to this, but oh, that is not very smart. Don't be a me. Don't do it. But I'm using this as a teaching moment to say that allergy tests can be good. My phone's ringing, so I'm gonna go. Hello, I've just took a shower. I love this t-shirt. It's like Corpse Bride. Emily from Corpse Bride. 
<clears throat> my voice sounds weird because I don't know actually why it sounds weird. Probably because I haven't had a drink all day, I've been asleep all day. Um, trying to find some socks for my little bag of socks. Ta da! Cherry as it is, but the time is 47 minutes past two. And oh! <laughs> I just blow dried my piercing. It's doing good, I'll give you an update in a minute. I'm just going to get dressed first. I'm going to sneeze, hold on. <laughs> mm -hmm. No, I'm good. Right, belly button update. Do, do, do. It's doing really, really well. It doesn't even hurt anymore. A little bit of redness, but that's about it. It's doing really well. And it's not even a month old yet. Look at it go. It looks great. Like I said, a little bit of redness, but apart from that, it is doing really well. Hold on. Yeah. I'm really proud of my little belly button piercing. Uh, let's show you the fit for today, actually. <laughs> Normally I'd go over there, but there's a bed in the way. We have the Corpse Ride t-shirts underneath that I just showed you guys. Hold on. We have these grey joggers, this hoodie, and my glasses are somewhere, because I need to wear them, but... Yeah, that's the fit. Don't want to get copyrighted. <laughs> I was I was saying this to Tristan, wasn't I, Tristan? That I've got my um guy with the uniform now. It wasn't letting me before. Now I finally have him. Look at it go. Yeah, cool. I look so cool. I'm literally show you guys something. Look, there's my character. It's um, where it got blew up, but amazing. I never before was able to have my, um, hold on. Before I wasn't allowed, my, not allowed, but it wasn't loading in my character. It just kept giving me the default. So I'm really glad that it's loading in now. Maybe um, it'll load in for the missions as well now. you have to, um, kind of... I won. I won the Grunt Apocalypse, and I'm so proud of myself. Woo! You got this little cameraman. Right, Tristan's being the cameraman. Right, ready? Oh. Hair gummy. Wait, what do they Good look job, like? Good job, cameraman. What do they look like again? I'll show you now. And apple flavour. I'm just explaining to Tristan how hair gummies work. All done for the day. Took my one for the day, haven't I, I Tristan? Hold it for you now. I'm alright, thanks, my love. But thank you for being such a good cameraman. Yeah. Yeah, he was the best, wasn't he, guys? I'm sitting in my bed. Well, I think that's the end of this vlog. Um, what time is it? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Um. 44 minutes past 10 at night, uh, 1st of March, still 2024. My head feels fucking weird. It's that weird weirdness. I don't know how to explain it. It just feels weird. But I do want to film my music I discovered uh, in February video. I was about to say this month, but it's March now, 1st of March. Um, I do want to film that video. Also... Um, I'm putting my glasses back on because my head feels weird. Oh, hold on. Hold on. There we go. Right, anyways. That feels weird. I put that on wrong. Anyways. Also, um, I signed myself up to tomorrow go to an open day for a university. Don't think I'm going to university, but more just curiosity, you know? More just curiosity. So we'll see how that goes tomorrow. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to export this footage. I don't know why I keep doing that. I've got this in my head. It's like that. It's half a heart. I used to do it all the time with someone. And it's in my head at the moment. But, um, yeah. Um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. I'm going to film my music I discovered, like, in February video. Um, and then, I don't know. But thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. Um, I really appreciate it. Um, subscribe to become my between Our Quest Madness. I'm Madeline, and I never say that. And until next time.
Goodbye, guys. Have a lovely day. Goodbye. Have a lovely day.